Hey everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you a few ways to run the Epic Games Store on Linux. Quick note, all of these applications can be found in a flat pack to make things easy for you. This way you don't have to go dependency chasing and it also may be helpful for Steam Deck users. I was looking around the internet and since the release of Hogwarts Legacy being free for this current week, uh, I've seen a lot of people were having issues with Heroic Games Launcher. So I wanted to show you a few different alternatives. As you can see in the background, we have the game running. I'm just going to go ahead and exit this game and show you that it was running on Heroic Games Launcher. That worked for me. I'm currently using Cache OS. So what I'm going to do is first show you the Lutris way, which is another way I would prefer to do this. We're going to go to the plus button and search for installers, and I'm going to type Epic Games. Click on Epic Game Store and just continue all the way. Once it's done, you'll hit close and then you can go ahead and launch Epic Game Store and log in. One important thing to note is that with Lutris, I have it set up so it pulls the latest Proton GE. So that's what we're using to run Epic Game Store. All right, and now once you're logged in, you can go to your library. And this one functions more like the Windows version. We can go ahead and install Hogwarts Legacy from here. All right, so there's another way we can do this. We're gonna launch the August launcher. Once you launch this, you wanna hit the plus button and under the games and app category, you wanna go down to Epic Games. And using Proton GE latest will get you the latest one, which at the time of recording is 10.26. You can make a shortcut anywhere you like. I'm just gonna keep it in the application. Once it's downloaded, I can go ahead and launch it. All right, and it's the same thing here. Once we're logged in, we're able to go ahead and head to our library. And we can go ahead and download it from here. Another option I'd like to show you here is Port Proton. Uh, this one has a bunch of launchers already ready to install. We're gonna go ahead and click on Epic Games Launcher. I'm not gonna add shortcuts here. We're just gonna keep it confined to the application. And this one's actually a little more involved. It gives us options to change a few things, but we're gonna keep it default for now. And here, once again, we can go ahead and log in. There you have a few options. I've seen people, like I mentioned earlier, running into issues with just having a Heroic Games Launcher. These are three other different ways you could try it. But yeah, hopefully this helps somebody out there. Uh, Epic Games is about to start their Christmas giveaways where they give away one game every day till New Year. And I've already seen the leaks for some of the games coming out and you might not want to miss this one. So I found it a very opportune time to show you guys how to do this so that you can claim your games and enjoy them on Linux. That's going to be it for me. If you liked the video, please give the video a like, subscribe for more. I want to thank you all for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.